Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Hardcore Minecraft. In the last episode, we kind of got reacquainted with the world, and now we are back down here mining. Uh, what are we looking for? Well, we are looking for resources. We're going to start looking to get uh, diamonds, emeralds, lapis, uh, hopefully. Do I actually have diamonds yet? I do have diamonds. If I could find some lava and some water, we could build another, for or another portal. We could build a enchantment table. Those would be really nice things, I would think. Oh man, speaking of lava, I hear some now. Hopefully, this goes pretty well though. Oh look, no it's not, because there's lava. <laughs> Alright, well hey, I am actually getting two of these recorded, not back to back, but, um, so, I, I guess I should talk a little bit about the last recording session. I tried to use OBS to record it, and for some reason, it was causing my voice to become super compressed, for like no reason. So now I'm going back to using Fraps and Audacity, and we'll see how this sounds. It should sound pretty good, but, you know, who knows? My life might be just like, ah, man, this thing that used to work on your old computer and every other computer before it doesn't work anymore. Just, it's, it's dead. Dead now. Alright, let's get this gold, though. Anyway, I don't think that should be the case. I'm just being overdramatic, I, I suppose. So let's keep on mining through here. Hey, look, redstone. I like me some redstone. Uh, what I would like to do is I'd like to actually get an automated farm going. Though I built one on a regular survival world. And it took me a bit of time, but that's also because I don't know how to measure anything, apparently. So, you know, if I actually, you know, measure well this time, that won't be so much of a problem. Also, I like how I just got, like, a random lag spike for no reason. That's beautiful. What's really interesting is I'm currently recording at... Uh, 260 frames, 270. I'm sorry, my bad. Anyway, and but like suddenly I'll get random lag spikes. I'm currently running. Um, oh right, I forgot to change that back to normal. Um, I'm running at a render distance of eight, so we'll see how that makes things fair. Um, I I like running things at 32, but typically that or 32 chunks, but typically that's too intensive. It causes too much lag. Um, I, can, I can actually understand why most servers have their render distance capped out at 10. Because, like, even if you set your render distance up to quote-unquote far, they won't let you see any more than 10, and that's probably to help reduce server lag. So that kind of makes sense, at least. So what is Thawan up to today? Well, Thawan is avoiding Overwatch. Why is he avoiding Overwatch? Because today he can't seem to win any matches. Because, you know, that's been fun, losing over and over. Oh, I, I got one draw! Does one draw count? It doesn't? Okay. No, I'm, I'm just kidding. But I, I have been having uh, pretty terrible luck at uh, Overwatch lately. So that's why we're in the land of Minecraft. Because Minecraft, I at least know what's going to happen most of the time. Unless it's just a random creeper coming out of nowhere to blow me up in my stuff. But, for the most part, I know how to handle most, thi or most things. So I would actually like to get this series going a little bit faster. What I should be doing is doing all this like uh, resource gathering between videos. But hey, I like I like just talking for a while because I like to hear myself talk. Not really. I actually hate the sound of my own voice, which makes editing videos pretty difficult. Actually, look at all this awesome stuff we're getting. Mm mm mm. Coal. I love coal. Coal is my friend. Coal lights my house up at night. Anyway, so yeah, let's get the last of this coal. I think after I get this stuff, I'm going to go ahead and head back. I have enough resources that I feel like that we could start probably looking at uh, starting an enchantment area. And I also do want to uh, build our house a bit more than it is, you know, just a pole in the wall. Yeah, let's go ahead and head back. And with the power of editing, we are back. I'm making this place darker than ever. Alright, and let's go ahead and get some obsidian mined up. Which, probably gonna end up speeding through anyway, because look how long this is gonna take. Yay. No, not really, yay. Anyway, let's uh, speed this up and see about how long it takes in speed up. Actually, I'm gonna put the water down just in case.
All right, and there we go. We got our 18 obsidian. Let's head back up now. All right, I think up here looks as good as any other to build a nether portal. All right, let's go ahead and put this up here. And one, two, excuse you. Here, three, there we go. Just use the tree to build, it's fine. All right, and there we go, nether portal, and all we gotta do is, bam, light it. Now, should we go to the nether? Probably not, but I like to live dangerously. Not really, but uh, we'll see how this goes. We need to go deeper. Oh, brains. There's brains in front of me. Hey, nether quartz. I'll take some of that. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mm -mm -mm. Delicious. I like how this texture pa pack makes all this stuff look like brains, though. <laughs> anyway, just uh, gonna fix that hole real quick. Make it so we don't have to watch that first step quite so badly. All right, and glowstone looks very interesting in this texture pack, I gotta say. All right, and let's grab some more nether quartz. So this actually, I'm being kind of ballsy here, I'll admit, because um, normally I don't like going into the nether period, and we're going into the nether on hard mode with iron armor and an iron sword. No enchantments. Normally I like to have enchantments before I come into the nether. Uh, but... Living life dangerously. Otherwise, uh, this probably would be very boring. So let's go ahead and grab some soul sand. We don't need soul sand right now, but if we want to make potions, we're going to need some to uh, grow nether wart down the road. I'm going to go ahead and grab some of this. I'm glad this doesn't act like regular sand and just like fall down when you update it if it's like hanging off of a cliff. That would really suck if that was the case because we'd probably be dead right now. Just, well, it's just saying. Alright, and I got almost a stack of uh, soul sand. Let's go and grab a little bit more. Let's see. Mine, 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 mine. What am I, Seagull, from Finding Nemo? Probably. Also, I find it interesting that soul sand uh, slows you down as much as it does. Um, but, if you didn't know, if you put ice on top of soul sand, it actually slows you down even more. Also, I'm being serenaded by the trucks. Serenaded, I tell you absolutely serenaded. I don't know why they go down that hill as loudly as they do. I'm not sure if it's because they just leave it in a lower gear and it causes the engine to go get all loud like that, or if it's like part of their brakes just being obnoxiously loud because they're using the loud brakes rather than the quiet brakes. And yes, that is supposedly a thing. I'm gonna need some more blocks if I'm gonna want a pillar over. Also, I should have probably written down the coordinates of where my portal is. Probably. Where is my portal? Don't tell me I'm already lost. So, uh, that didn't take long. Pretty sure it's over here. Yeah, here it is. Alright, so this is at about negative uh, 10 and 35. Negative 10 and 35. Oh man, that half heart of fall damage, kind of. Kind of, sort of, maybe. So let's actually grab some more of this. Should be really using the iron pick first for this stuff. Just because the diamond pick's kind of my backup slash go uh, mine obsidian. <laughs> so let's go ahead, grab some of this. We're going to use this as uh, basically bridge material. Even though it's not necessarily the best in the nether because it can be blown up by a gas. But hopefully we don't see any. And if we do, hopefully I kill them. As soon as I say it, I swear. Every god dang time. Every god dang time. You shut your mouth. Nope. Quiet. Because nobody likes you. So what we're looking for in here actually is another fortress. I'd really like to find one of those. Oh, there you are. He's going to fire his laser bar, but he backed off. Oh, oh. Um... I don't think that's how that achievement was supposed to be gotten. Oh, that's a magma cube. I actually don't know what the nether bricks look like in this uh, texture pack, interestingly enough. And die, please. Die, please. Thank you. Thank you. You didn't drop anything, though, did you? Nope. You know, really, all we have to really look for is a flying blaze man, and we should be fine. Also, blaze men are fun. Hello. 
I'm exploring the nether. Please give me your bountiful fruits of nether fortresses. I nether fortress. I nether fortress. I ow. Oh, that didn't kill me. Come on, place the block. Play, place it. Place it. I could probably hollow this the rest of the way out just because it gives me a little bit of being blown up. Shelter, let me guess, another drop. Basically another drop, yeah. Uh, one more? One more, okay. And boop, boop, and boop, boop. One more. Hoop. I love trying to, like, just build as I go, make my... Uh, make myself a easy way to get back. Because if I just jump down, I'm probably going to end up screwing myself. I, I don't like the way this lava is looking at me. Also, hello there, zombie pigman. I'm so glad you didn't walk into me as I started mining. Because then I would have hit you. And then you would have been angry. And all your friends would have been angry. And then I would have been dead. So let's see here. Okay. And I could walk around this. But I'm going to block it up. Oh, I'm in the lava. Why would I do this to myself? <sighs> Goodbye, armor. Ow. Okay, please stop. Please? No. Okay. Jesus Christ. Let's get some regen up in here. I'm going to leave my armor off for... Well, I could probably put the armor in now. I'm just regening. Let's say that the armor will take lots of damage when you take fire damage. I saw that little like drop, like a moment before I hit it. Okay, watch my shift just stop working right here, right now. Be my luck. Oh, let's let's just go on the soul sand. I don't even care anymore. I just really want to find a nether fortress. Well, how far have I gone? I've gone 400 blocks and I still can't find one. Typically, they're actually really close to where your first nether portal spawns in. Typically. Since I guess it's assumed that you'll spawn near like a zero zero or whatever. Or you'll build near, near zero zero. So I wonder if I should maybe head back. Huh. Well, I get... Found one. Okay, awesome. This is why I love Optifine. Optifine is my friend. So let's see here. I'm just gonna go ahead and mine right through this. Like I don't even care. Hopefully this doesn't lead out into basically lava. It probably will, knowing my luck. I know there's lava above me currently, but I really don't care. I really don't care. Let's, oh my god, it's gas. No, 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 please. I don't want. What I'm going to have to do is, um, probably what I'll do between episodes is I'll build a um, little bit of an express highway to get between this nether fortress and back into the nether portal. Although it depends on how good this uh, nether fortress is, if I really want to be coming back to it over and over. Although, I will admit this episode is going a little bit, or on a little bit long, so maybe I should cut it here, and we'll find out what's in the nether fortress next time. Yeah, look at that little bit of a cliffhanger here. Well, everyone, if you enjoyed this episode of Hardcore Minecraft, please hit that like button. If you'd like to see more, go ahead and subscribe. Either way, my name is Thawne, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye bye Don't want it. Also, I got an achievement because I was trying not to die. Yay! But I want to keep I, I want to keep a counter of it because I want to show, hey, this is how far we've come, this is how long we've survived. Uh, because I think that's actually a really cool concept. Let's go ahead and grab this stuff real quick. I think I want to say, and this is going to be really bad if I remember this. It's eight iron. Yep, looks like it's eight iron. Cool. I had a vision of your arrival. I have had psychic powers since I was a child. I first learned to bend spoons with my mind. 
I dislike fighting, but if you wish, I will show you my powers. The most overpowered.